stop you now! Johan! <laughs> Now, this is Absolute Cinema! Daishigun's Palace. War warning. Very well, Son Goku. I confess that I'm impressed with your performance. You are managing to reach a completely different level than anyone I imagine. The form of angels, the power of a god killer, is finally emerging over you. <laughs> ah, this is actually thanks to you, Grand Priest! That training I carried out with you in the empty dimension made me release a power that not even I believed I possessed. The ordeal of your training made me reach my limits. And with that, I reached the God Killer form. <laughs> Very good, Son Goku. But know that this training was to prepare you for the worst that is to come. They are approaching at an extremely fast speed. <clears throat> I know, Lord Daishikan. I will become even stronger. This battle will be decisive. I'm glad you're aware of that. Universe 11, Planet Belmont. <laughs> Look at Margarita. Do you think this decision to train this mortal from Universe 7 was a good decision? You see, he has hidden potential, but wouldn't that overshadow Jiren's brilliance? <laughs> You're always thinking about these questions of the universe, aren't you, Lord Belmont? <laughs> but at the same time, you know that something much bigger is coming, don't you? 
right. That's the only reason I'm allowing this boy from Universe 7 to go through Kai's ritual here in Universe 11. I hadn't expected this in millennia. Finally, a new sacred war is coming. Aren't the universe erased by Daishikun back? <laughs> by Daishikun, my father. I think I said too much. A long time ago. Seems like you don't listen to me, do you? How are we going to maintain the balance of the universe with this astronomical power occurring between these universes? The biggest disturbance between the universes is happening here. This is not something we can deal with. As if it were nothing, is it? <laughs> well, my dear Daishikan, this isn't like it's something that involves just you or any other universe. It involves much more than is beyond your thinking. What are you talking about? <laughs> it's not fair and I don't accept the system that is created by Zerosama and his guards. Who decided who has to live and die? Can't you agree with that, Daishikan? I will claim my right to reign over everything. Maybe your decision was wrong. Not being able to act like that, Zekai. <laughs> Stop it. Daishikan, you know very well that my power and the power of all universes allied with me are much greater than your power and everyone else's. You are the renowned Daishikan known as the father of angels, but I am the mother of angels. Don't try to stop me, Daishikan. <coughs> this is madness, Takai. You know very well that this is a mistake. <laughs> Get out of my way, Daishikan. Damn! Real ceiling! Current times, Universe 11. <clears throat> this place is totally different. I thought I was going to die after all the fights I had. My training with the Supreme Kai released some of my hidden power. But to fight in this war, I will have to release 100% of my potential. No! A thousand percent! Huh? Does this boy really think that a ritual with me will be the same thing as that ritual with that old pervert from Universe 7? <laughs> this is actually insulting to me, the Great Kai! <laughs> Even though I seriously analyzed this boy, what I'm going to say is almost impossible for a normal person to analyze, but it seems that this... This boy has a hidden potential that is even greater than Jiren's own! Who are you really, Son Gohan? However, you will suffer and run the risk of turning into cosmic dust to achieve this power. Let's see if you can do it, Son Gohan. <laughs> I'm ready, Mr. Kai! Universe 9, Bergamo, Lavender, and Basil, the trier of wolves from Universe 9, were training Curlin, Yancha, and Tien. I need to get stronger! Are you sure you want to fight with us? It's practically impossible for you to be able to lay a finger on us! You guys think you're too much! I'm the real wolf of Universe 7! <laughs> you did well, but you still have a long way to go. You let your guard down! Get going! Oh! <laughs> Take my poison! Yeah! Uh, what? Uh, I'm finished. <laughs> These guys are monsters. How Goku and the others defeated them so easily? Well, if the war approaches, you will have to become much stronger to be able to deal with these things. Even us! Red Planet, Universe 14. <laughs> I finally woke up. <laughs> I don't understand. Things here are strange. Where is everyone else? It's as if something has been changed. Oh, great Master Amron. You have finally woken up. It seems like we went through some witchcraft enchantment. And as a result, we don't remember anything that happened before. Oh, great Master Amron. It seems that in the ancient temple, there is something that is a message for you. <clears throat> Let me go there. Huh? A secret duel. Amaron, if you are seeing this message, you know that millennia ago we were imprisoned by Daishikan in Universe Zero. 
In two years, a war will begin where we'll be freed. In the meantime, give them a demonstration of your power. In my absence, I declare you the new god of destruction of Universe 14. <clears throat> I'm ready, Lord Dromel. <sighs> Venerable Heir Amaron, are you ready? Calculate the route. We will go after Daishikan. I have a message from Lord Dromo to give to him personally. <laughs> Universe 6, Planet Sadala. Come on, all of you! You need to get stronger! If a new war is really coming, with your level of strength, we will be massacred! There are much more powerful warriors in the universes who are given their all! Do the same! The king of this planet has assigned me to teach you how to become stronger! Hey, old man! Take it easy! You've barely arrived on our planet and you already wanted to give orders here! Uh, calm down, Khalifa son. Mr. Vegeta may be tough, but he's definitely just trying to help. If you think that standing there complaining will solve things, know that with this level of power, when the enemy appears, Everything you love most and all those you most want to protect will be eradicated. <laughs> That's really true. <sighs> I hate to agree with you. I'm ready for training. Huh? So you're the Saiyan of Universe 7. Know that I'm the one who dictates the rules here. <sighs> Prove to me that you're worthy of training my people. That? To be continued. The warning of war is finally coming. Each Z warrior is undergoing different training. What is really happening in the midst of all this? Click the like button and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any chapters. This is going to be cinema! Gohan's resolve remained steadfast as he followed Turles and Bojack deeper into the foreboding landscapes of the Makai realm. The air grew heavier with ominous energy, and the sky above them seemed perpetually shrouded in darkness. As they ventured through the twisted terrain, Gohan's senses were on high alert. He could feel the subtle vibrations of dark power emanating from hidden corners, indicating that they were not alone in this accursed place. Turles glanced back at Gohan with a mixture of weariness and begrudging respect. You've grown stronger, kid. But don't think you can confront our master so easily. Gohan remained silent, his focus a wavering. He knew that confronting this master, higher authority, would not be a straightforward task. But he was determined to uncover the truth behind the disruptions in the timelines. After what felt like an eternity of navigating through the treacherous landscape, they arrived at the towering citadel. Its dark spires reaching into the skies like jagged claws. Turles and Bojack stopped before the colossal gates, which creaked open with an eerie groan, revealing a cavernous interior shrouded in shadows. Bojack gestured for Gohan to enter. Our master awaits within. Just remember, you asked for it. Gohan nodded, his expression resolute. With each step he took into the depths of the citadel, he steeled himself for the challenges that lay ahead. Whatever waited him inside, Gohan was prepared to confront it head on in his quest to restore order to the timelines. Gohan's skepticism intensified as he listened to Turles and Bojack's warnings about their mysterious master. I appreciate the warning, but I need to see this for myself. With determined strides, Gohan ventured deeper into the sprawling realm of Makai. The ominous aura weighing heavily upon him the landscape seemed to pulse with malevolent energy, and shadows danced at the corners of his vision. As he traversed the desolate terrain, Gons encountered other sinister things, creatures twisted by darkness and malice. Some eyed him with suspicion, while others skittered away into the shadows. Gohan remained vigilant, seeking clues that might unravel the mysteries veiled within this realm. In the distance, Gohan spotted a spectral figure observing him from afar, a Makayoshin cloaked in darkness. Sensing Gohan's presence, the figure vanished into the shadow, leaving Gohan with more questions than answers.
Hours passed as Gohan continued his solitary exploration. He sought out pockets of resistance against the darkness, hoping to find allies amidst this bleak landscape. Finally, Gohan stumbled upon a hidden enclave where remnants of resistance's fighters gathered. A weathered Makayoshin approached Gohan cautiously. You're not one of them, the figure remarked, eyeing Gohan's determined countenance. What brings you here, to this forsaken place? Gohan explained his quest to uncover the truth behind the disruptions in the timelines and the mysterious forces at play. Then Makayoshin nodded gravely, acknowledging the gravity of Gohan's mission. You speak of powerful forces manipulating our realm. <sighs> There is a darkness that even we struggle against. A darkness that seeks to subjugate us all. Gohan's resolve hardened as he listened. He realized that his journey was far from over. It was only just beginning. As Gohan ventured deeper into the shadows of Makai Realm, unaware of the watchful eyes that tracked his every move, a clandestine meeting was underway in a mysterious chamber within the Makai Shin Palace. The atmosphere crackled with tensions. As the Migra, the prince of the Makayoshins, addressed Toa, the brilliant scientist Makayoshin, and Mira, the enigmatic warrior. It seems we have an intruder in our midst. <laughs> our realm is not accustomed to visitors, especially those who possess such formidable power. Perhaps this intruder could prove us useful, Toa regarded. Or they could pose a threat. Mira, standing silently by the Migra's side, added. Regardless, we must ensure that our secrets remain hidden. This intruder must be dealt with with swiftly and decisively. Meanwhile, Gohan's exploration led him to the outskirts of the Makayoshin Palace, a foreboding structure shrouded in darkness. As he cautiously approached, Gohan sensed an unsettling presence within his shadowed halls. Unbeknownst to Gohan, he was about to encounter forces far beyond his expectations. Deep within the palace, Toa's eyes gleamed with anticipation. Mira stood vigilant, and the Migra plotted in silence. Their intentions veiled in shadows as they prepared for the inevitable confrontation with the intruder who dared to challenge the realm of Makai. Toa's gaze flickered with a mix of curiosity and cunning as she considered the potential of capturing the intruder. Indeed. This visitor's resilience in the Makai realm is quite intriguing. Imagine the knowledge we could glean from a throughout analysis of their physiology. It could prove beneficial to our research, Miram remarked, his voice a deep rumble. Demigra, the prince of the Makaioshids, remained silent for a moment, his mind calculating. Very well, but we must exercise caution. This intruder possesses a remarkable strength. Underestimate them at your own peril. With a shared understanding, Toa and Mira began to outline their plan to capture the intruder. Their expressions a blend of scientific curiosity and strategic foresight. Meanwhile, Gohan ventured deeper into the shadowy corridors of the Makayoshin Palace. His senses heightened as he navigated the labyrinthine structure. Every step brought him closer to the heart of this mysterious realm, where secrets lurked in the shadows and unseen forces plotted against him. As the Migra wielded his staff, a sinister energy emanated from his tip, pinpointing Gohan's exact location within the palace labyrinth. A wicked green spread across the Migra's face as he reveled in the opportunity to test the young warrior's mettle. <laughs> this is the perfect chance to assess the potential of our unexpected guest. With a flick of his wrist, Amigra conjured the fearsome Makai demon, imbued with dark energy and a thirst for conflict. The creature materialized in a surge of shadow and malice, its eyes glowing with an ominous light. Go! Find the intruder and guard his strength! Let us see what this interloper is truly capable of! The Makai demon let out a cultural ground before vanishing into the shadows, its form melding seamlessly with the dark corridors of the palace. As it prowled through the eerie passageways, Gohan's presence drew closer, each step echoing with purpose. Meanwhile, Gohan remained vigilant, his senses attuned to the subtle shifts in the atmosphere. Unbeknownst to him, the Makai demon stalked his trail, 
its malevolent intent concealed within the shadows. As the tension mounted within the palace depths, a confrontation between Gohan and the forces of darkness loomed on the horizon. As Gohan navigated the labyrinthine corridors of the Makai Realm, a sudden, unexpected attack hurtled towards him. With lightning reflexes, Gohan leaped aside, narrowly evading the menacing strike that cleaved through the air where he had stood. As the dust settled, Gohan's gaze locked onto the source of the aggression, a grotesque creature that materialized from the shadows. Its form was twisted and sinister, its eyes glinting with a malevolent gleam. So, you're the one sent to stop me, Gohan remarked, his voice laced with determination. The Makai demon emitted a grudural growl, its features contorted in malice. With a swift movement, he launched towards Gohan, claws outstretched. Gohan braced himself, his muscles coiling with anticipation. With a swift motion, he sidestepped the demon's attack, countering with a decisive strike of his own. His fist connected with the creature's midsection, sending it hurtling backwards. Despite the impact, the Makai demon regained its footing, its eyes narrowing with newfound intensity. Gohan remained composed, his resolve unwavering as he prepared for the next exchange. As the battle unfolded in the shadowed recesses of the Makai realm, Gohan's thoughts raced. He knew this encounter was more than a mere test. It was a glimpse into the malevolent forces at play within this enigmatic domain. As Gohan's power surged, his aura radiated with a brilliant intensity, illuminating the shadows that cloaked the Makai realm. His transformation into the ultimate form signaled a shift in the confrontation, a declaration of unwavering resolve. I've had enough of these games. Tell me who's behind all this. The Makai demon, undeterred by Gohan's transformation, remained silent. Its malevolent gaze fixed on its opponent. Gohan's patience wore thin as he confronted the creature, seeking answer amidst the eerie silence that enveloped them. With a determined stride, Gohan closed the distance between them. The Makai demon snarled, landing forward and once more with renewed ferocity. Gohan met the attack head on, his movements fluid and precise. As the clash intensified, Gohan's thoughts raced. He grappled with the implications of this encounter, the darkness that pervaded the Makai realm. The enigmatic figures, the darkness that pervaded the Makai realm, the enigmatic figures pulling the strings from the shadows. This battle was not only a test of strength, but a quest for truth. A quest to uncover the malevolent forces that threatened the stability of the universes. With each strike, Gohan pushed himself further, his resolve unyielding. The silence of the Makai demon spoke volumes, driving him to delve deeper into the mysteries that lay concealed within this realm. As Gohan confronted the creature in the Makai realm, in the shadowy halls of the Migris Palace, the Makaishin prince watched with malicious smile. His eyes gleamed with a mixture of anticipation and amusement as he monitored the battle through the mystical artifacts. Let's see how this intruder fares against my creation, the Migra murmured to himself, his voice echoing through the dark chambers of the palace. He was determined to test the limits of the warrior who dare enter his realm. The Migra's eyes narrowed as he manipulated the threads of fate, observing every move of Gohan and the creature he had sent to confront him. He was curious to see how long Gohan could resist before succumbing to the darkness that pervaded the Makai realm. Meanwhile, deep within the palace, Toa and Mira watched with interest. Toa, the Makaioshin scientist, studied the events with a calculating expression, capturing every detail for her own experiments. Mira, Toa's creation and an imposing cybernetic warrior, stood silently beside his mistress, his red eyes gleaming with a cold intensity. He patiently awaited the unfolding of events, ready to intervene if necessary. We stood beside Beerus on the tranquil planet of Beerus. The calm ambience belying the tension that pervaded the realm. The angelic attendant turned to the god of destruction with a contemplative expression. Do you think Gohan is faring well in the Makai realm? <laughs> that Saiyan brat always surprises me. He'll manage. Beerus replied with a hint of nonchalance, though a flicker of concern danced in his eyes. Wheeze nodded thoughtfully, his staff tapping lightly against the ground. Hmm. Goha's potential is quite remarkable. 
I'm sure he'll find a way to navigate the challenges of the Makai realm. Well, he better. I don't have time for distractions. As the two cosmic entities contemplated Gohan's fate, unknown to them, the young Saiyan was embroiled in a fierce battle within the depths of the Makai realm, confronting adversaries whose origins were shrouded in darkness and deception. Gohan's determination burned brightly as he sought to uncover the truth behind the disturbances in the timelines. Unaware of the sinister forces plotting against him, Gohan strikes slides through the air with precision, but the elusive demon creature evaded each attack effortlessly. The creature's agility was unmatched, moving with an otherworldly grace that left Gohan momentarily off balance. Gritting his teeth, Gohan adjusted his stance. His mind races to assess the situation. This creature's power level, it's on a whole different scale compared to Turles and Bojack. The demon creature launched forward, its movements fluid and unpredictable. Gohan barely managed to dodge the flurry of razor-sharp claws that tore through the air where he had stood moments before. I won't be able to break through with brute force alone! In the shadows of the Makai realm, Demigra observed the battle with a twisted grin, his eyes gleaming with anticipation. Show me what you're truly capable of, Gohan! The stakes were high and Gohan knew that he couldn't afford to hold back any longer. He had to defeat this demon once and for all. As the demon creature unleashed a torrent of colossal attacks, Gohan found himself pressed to the limit. Massive energy blasts tore through the air, creating shockwaves that threatened to overwhelm him. Gohan gritted his teeth, weaving and dodging with all his might to evade the onslaught. The ground trembled beneath Gohan's feet as he leaped and twisted, narrowly escaping each explosive attack. The relentless barrage pushed them to his limits, but Gohan refused to yield. Gohan's mind raced, seeking a weakness in his opponent's relentless assault. He needed a moment to strike back, to turn the tide of battle. Amidst the chaos, Gohan's determination surged. He focused his energy, tapping into the depths of his latent power. The golden aura surrounding him intensified, crackling with untapped potential. I won't let you overwhelm me! With a burst of speed, he propelled himself forward, aiming a decisive strike at the demon creature. The impact sent shockwaves rippling through the Makai realm, momentarily staggering the creature. Gohan seized the opportunity, unleashing a rapid barrage of punches and kicks with calculated precision. The demon creature staggered under the onslaught, its defenses faltering. Gohan's attacks intensified, fueled by his resolve to uncover the truth behind the disturbances in the timeline. Meanwhile, in the shadowy recesses of the Makai Palace, Demigra's sinister smile widened. Impressive! But can you handle what's yet to come, Saiyan? Demigra's gaze bore into the unfolding battle, eager to witness Gohan's next move. Demigra reclined on his opulent throne, his malevolent gaze fixed on a crystal clear screen pool that revealed Gohan's intense battle with the demon creature. As Gohan unleashed a flurry of attacks, Demigra's lips curled into the cruel smile. <laughs> He's putting up quite the struggle, isn't he? But we both know where this is ending. Shall I prepare the extraction device, my lord? Toa inquired, her eyes glinting with anticipation. Yes, Toa! The Saiyan's body will make a perfect vessel for my ambitions. Once he's weakened, it will be the perfect opportunity. As Gohan continued to trade blows with the demon creature, Demigra's dark laughter echoed through the corridors of his palace. Let him exhaust himself. Soon, the Saiyan will belong to us. As Gohan's battle with the demon creature reached its peak, a surge of raw, untamed power erupted from within him. The air crackled with electricity as Gohan's aura flared with intensity, causing the very foundations of the Makai realm to tremble. Toa's eyes widened in astonishment as she sensed the overwhelming energy radiating from Gohan's transformed state. What monstrous energy is this? Beside her, the Migra's expression shifted from amusement to intrigue. Oh, so the Saiyan has hidden depths. This changes everything. The demon creature, caught off guard by Gohan's sudden transformation, faltered for a moment. Gohan's eyes blazed with determination as he unleashed a devastating barrage of attacks, each strike resonating with primal ferocity. In the depths of his palace, the Migra watched with a newfound sense of anticipation. Let's see how far this beast within can take him. As Gohan tapped into his beast mode, 
His senses sharpened to an uncanny degree. He effortlessly predicted the creature's every move, sidestepping attacks with preternatural grace. With each dodge, Gohan countered with a flurry of devastating punches that struck true against his foe. The creature taken aback by Gohan's newfound prowl struggled to keep up. Gohan's strikes were relentless, each blow carrying the weight of his determination to uncover the truth behind the disturbances of the timelines. Finally, as the creature staggered from Gohan's onslaught, Gohan gathers his energy. The swirling blue energy crackled around him, illuminating the dark expanse of the Makai realm. Ka-me. Ha-me. Gohan shouted, unleashing the devastating wave of energy. The beam surged forward with unstoppable force, engulfing the creature in a blinding explosion of light. As the smoke cleared, Gohan stood panting, his beast mode subsiding. He glanced around, his gaze steely and determined. <sighs> Toa, Demiga, I'm coming for you. Gohan reverted to his base form deliberately suppressing his energy to avoid detection by the Archaioshins. The eerie silence of the realm enveloped him as he moved swiftly through the shadows, concealing his presence. As he navigated the treacherous terrain, Gohan's mind raced with thoughts of Toa, Demigra, and the mysterious disturbances in the timelines. He knew he was closing in on something significant, but the darkness of the Makai realm concealed every danger. Gohan remained alert, his senses finally attuned to any signs of movements or danger. He moved with purpose, determined to gather more information and confront those responsible for manipulating time and space. In the distance, the ominous silhouette of the Migras Palace loomed, a stark reminder of the challenges ahead. Gohan steeled himself, his resolve unshaken. He would not rest until he unraveled the mysteries of the Makai Row and put an end to the disruptions threatening the fabric of existence. <sighs> Maybe I didn't need to go to beast mode, but who knows what other enemies lurk in this place. <sighs> the Makai Realm was fraught with uncertainty, its shadows concealing untold dangerous. Gohan's instincts told him that his adversaries were not limited to Turles and Bojack. Toa and Amigra's presence hinted at a deeper conspiracy, one that threatened not only his world, but the entire cosmic balance. He pressed on, navigating the eerie landscapes with caution. Each step forward brought him closer to unraveling the tangled web of the seat woven by the Makaioshins. Gohan knew that the path ahead was perilous, but he was determined to uncover the truth and protect his reality from further manipulation. Toa leaned over the console, her crimson eyes fixed on the data streaming across the screen. I've analyzed the intruder energy signature. No doubt about it, he's a Saiyan. Oh, don't you say, I already knew that. Well, that's still intriguing. That explains already the massive power. I mustn't underestimate him. Saiyans are known for their tenacity and potential to grow stronger, especially when pushed to their limits. Perhaps this Saiyan could prove useful in our plans. If we can harness his strength, maybe. Agreed. I'll continue monitoring him closely. <laughs> There's much we can learn from this encounter. Toa's eyes gleamed with a mischievous glint as she considered the possibilities. This could be quite intriguing. If we can extract and replicate the Saiyan DNA, we could enhance Mirror's power exponentially. Oh, <laughs> indeed we can. I see the potential benefits of infusing Mira with Saiyan genetics. It might grant him unprecedented strength and resilience. But first, we need to capture this Saiyan and obtain a valuable sample of his DNA. The Mira's malicious grin Mira tore us. Let us observe the Saiyan's progress. When the time is right, we'll strike and claim what we need. <laughs> As Koan continued his stealthy exploration of the Makai realm, unaware of the plotting Makai Shin striking his every move, the ominous alliance of Toa and the Migra prepared to unleash their sinister machinations upon the unsuspecting warrior. Migra's eyes narrowed, 
as he sensed the sudden absence of the intruder's energy within the Makai realm. <laughs> it appears our Saiyan guest has taken measures to conceal himself. We mustn't let him slip away. These Saiyans hold the key to our plans. We'll need to deploy our forces and search every corner of the Makai realm. He cannot hide forever. I'll coordinate with Mira and the others. We'll track down our elusive Saiyan and bring him to us. One way or another. In the depths of the Dark Palace, the ambitions of Makaioshins prepare to mobilize their formidable resources, determined to capture the Saiyan warrior whose untapped potential held the promise of unimaginable power. To be continued. So hey, what do you believe in? What do you imagine about all of this? Don't you forget to click the like button, subscribe here to the channel, then hit the bell so you don't miss any videos. And that's it for today. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.